Hey everybody, uh, I want to teach you a song today by Michael Gunger called uh, Beautiful Things and I want to teach you this song in standard tuning. And when he plays it he uses drop D tuning which is tuning your lower E string to a low D but let's say you're in a situation where you're leading live worship and you don't have time to tune down. I want to teach you this song in standard tuning. What you're going to want to do is there's um, basically four chords in this song. G and D, B minor 7, which you can play as a bar chord or an open chord, and A. And those are all the chords in the song, basically. He adds some diminished and some um, uh, add and suspended chords in there along the way, but those are the basic chords. But the G chord, you actually want to use your middle finger up here on the high, on the big E string, third fret, and you want to put your ring finger, third fret, on the B string, and your pinky on the G string, fourth fret, and it sounds like this. Okay? And I think it's like a G9 chord, actually, if you were to chord it out. Okay? But one of the things that he does is he uses this C sharp note right here, which is second uh, fret B string. And he throws that in there. And then you can walk it up to the um, third fret B string. And then the D chord. Okay, so it sounds like something like this. And you can, I'm using a pick and you can use a hybrid picking technique where you just use these fingers to so I'm hitting the E string and then I'm plucking up the higher strings with my fingers so it's like the strings you want to lay your thumb over on top of the E string to mute it out so it doesn't there's plenty of volume in all your other strings to get that that big pull D, D chord that they hit during the you Obviously, it's going to add more if you lower the um, E string to a D, but you can still basically get the song, okay? So, another way to play it, if you don't want to use your middle finger, is you can use your thumb to wrap around and play the low G string while playing this chord up here. And then the... That's just on the D string. You want to do open, second fret, fourth fret, G string. You want to play at the second fret. He also does it. So open, second, fourth, second, open, all on the D string. But there are licks where he goes open, second, fourth on the D string, and then second fret of the G string while he's playing the D chord. So you want to use your first finger and your pinky to or okay also he does a little walk down and this is kind of i'm following along with his vocal part a little bit when he's on the g uh chord he'll use the the g string up here the high string to walk down to He's got his pinky on the fourth. Put your first finger on the second fret of the G string and then open and then go to the B minor seven chord. So A and then G. Okay. 
so those are basically a, a few ways that you can play it using standard tuning. The only other part that you need to learn how to play, and the timing of this is critical, is the instrumental part, which is kind of like a, a solo section. He's using um, octaves, so he uh, starts on the D chord, which is first finger A string on the fifth fret, your middle finger on the seventh fret of the G string. Okay? And he drapes his fingers over, or you can do this to mimic this solo. So you want to do fifth fret to the ninth fret, and then fifth, fourth fret, ninth, fourth, second, fourth, ten, nine. So the actual chords are D, F sharp, D, C sharp, F sharp. C sharp, B, C sharp, G, F sharp. And if the, the rhythm is like this. Okay? So practice that a little bit to get that exact rhythm because it, it it matters in this song. I, I see a lot of tutorials that aren't nailing that rhythm exactly and it sounds a little funny. So you have to just kind of loosen up and just try to, you know, work on the timing. Okay? And mute out the other strings so that the only strings ringing out are your A and your G string. Okay? Alright, so hope this helps. Um, this is a great way to just not have to worry about lowering or detuning. You can just stay in standard tuning, still play the song, and it sounds great. This is Mark with Soul Shelter Mu Music. If you have any questions, send me an email, post a comment here. Please subscribe to my channel. There will be a lot more videos coming out uh, as time goes along. God bless.